if you are using TeamViewer to connect to other devices and you need to get that session code, I'm going to show you exactly where to find it and how you can send it and use it when you receive it. So let's wrap our heads and get into it. So in order to get this right, you need to have the right version of TeamViewer. And if you're on their download page, you'll have to download the one that says if you want to provide support. So this is the one you're looking for and you'll download the appropriate version. So we're in TeamViewer now. This is what this app looks like. And on the left hand side, you'll see remote support. Make sure that you are in there and you're going to go up to the top of this page and it says create a session. Now, once you open this dialog over here, we can just skip this tour. Once we open this dialog over here, you'll be able to create a session and you can give it a name and then share this link. You can also invite participants via email. So you can go ahead and add that email in over here. And if you hit the share button over here, you'll get a list of apps that you can share with. So you can copy the session link, you can copy the session code, or you can copy the invitation and you can send it on whatever platform you prefer to send it on, be that WhatsApp or via email or whatever the case may be. Now, if this was helpful, drop us a like, share it with a friend, and we'll see you next time. Peace out.